Hey guys, it's Faith, and today I'm back with another crybaby video. Are we surprised? No, we're not. So, today I wanted to show you guys some of the new releases that I got. I got like the jogger sweatshirt set. I also got like these khaki kind of pants, like these work pants. I also got the stitched pants. I was really hoping to get the girlfriend jeans, like the mom jeans, but unfortunately I went to go check out and it was sold out of my size. Today I'm just going to run you through some of the things I got and give you guys my honest input as always. Um, and hopefully it can help you if you're thinking about purchasing something. Let's get to it. So the first item I wanted to show you guys was the nude knit hoodie. So this is on their website right now for $44. I thought this outfit looked really cute, especially the length of the sleeves. So she's wearing an extra small in this, and I got the extra small too. I think we have similar measurements, so it should look relatively similar to what's in the picture. Um, besides the fact that she's tan and I'm not, so I look like a potato. So I thought the sleeves would be like a little longer, like these like go to the right length, like they go to my... I look like so creepy, like they go right to my wrist, um, but for her it goes like past her wrist, which I think that looks cuter. So the first impression that I had of this is I thought the inside was going to have like a cotton lining and be more comfortable, um, not saying that's not comfortable, it's just not what I expected. So it's the same material on the inside as it is on the outside. I'm just going to read off the website real quick. Um, I thought this was an interesting thing. I remember she posted about this and I was like, oh, I'm going to get that just, just because of this. So I'm taking a primate conservation course and I don't know, I'm just hating the environment. So the materials that it's made of is it's 50% tensile and 50% cotton. Um, so what tensile is, is I'm probably mispronouncing this, please forgive me. So what tensile is, is it's a fiber made from the wood pulp of trees that are grown and replaced on specialized tree farms. Unlike most cellulosic fabrics, um, tensile is produced using recyclable, earth-friendly solvents. When bleached with cotton, tensile adds wrinkle resistance and the lustrous feeling of silk. So, I wouldn't say that it feels <laughs> like silk, like it's still fabric. Um, but it's, I was trying to think all day of how to describe how this feels. Um, oh, so like, I guess like, maybe if you think about like a sweatshirt that you have, like it usually has something on the end, like for the cuff so that it's fitted around the wrist. Um, it kind of feels like that, but all throughout. So it'll fit um, to your body. It'll like stretch out, like if you're, uh, when, when you put it on, like it molds around your body. It's very stretchy. Like, I don't know if you can see, but like, and it'll like go back to the original form. It, it, it's great for the fit. I'm just really pale. So I look like a potato right now. Um, yeah, not a fan of that. I look like I stole a potato sack and a witch cursed me to look like the potato sack. Also, another thing I don't like is that you can see like imprints of things on this material. So I noticed that the joggers, which I'll show you guys in a second, like it's very see-through, so you can see like underwear lines and stuff, so I don't like that. <laughs> so onto the second item that I purchased, it is the second part of the set. It is the Nude Knit Joggers. Um, this is what it looks like on the website. Um, it retails for $44 on the website, and I should just say this now. Um, so if you accounted for the first item, the top and the bottom, it's $88 altogether for this set. Uh, I feel like that's just a really high price point. Um, I don't know if it's because of the material that it's made of and saving forest, maybe they donate to it, but it just seems kind of a little bit expensive for the set itself. I mean, I kind of look like a potato in it, so I might return it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> but I personally just don't think the colors go well with my skin tone, because um, I am fairly pale. <laughs> in case you haven't realized, I am I am very, very pale. It, it just doesn't look good on me. It doesn't mean that it's not gonna look good on everyone. Uh, it just doesn't look good on me. And also the strings for the joggers they're like really long. They're like ridiculously long. So yeah, I'm not, I'm actually not a huge fan of this set. I'm so sorry, crybaby. So I just wanted to show you guys up close real quick that this set is quite thin. 
Um, but I should also mention that it is very comfortable. Like I wore this for a few hours and I was definitely very comfortable. Um, I went to school in it, my lecture, I almost fell asleep in. Mostly because it's boring, but also because this is really comfortable. <laughs> So for the third item that I purchased, I got the High Society Pants. I loved how in these pictures it looked very clenched in at the waist and a little bit more loose fitting around the legs. I am going to be brutally honest, I was actually very disappointed with this one. Um, I'm wearing them right now and if you saw I was sitting on the floor before taking the videos I'm standing up now because I'm wearing them. I like just feel so squished by them and I know it, I know that you're gonna say like just get a size up and yeah I'm sure that I can but <laughs> if I'm going based off of my typical sizing I got an extra small and that stuff always fits um, but this is like ridiculous like like it flattens my butt it took me 10 minutes to zip up. It like, these pants, I, I give them like a negative two out of 10. I'm so sorry, crybaby, but like, I really don't like these ones. Girl. And they're, they're uh, I should mention, they're like really tight around the calves. I definitely recommend getting a size up if you do get these pants, but like, oh my God, I'm about to show you. I look so bad in these. So I just wanted to show you guys up close real quick. Um, I found that the belt loop holes were a bit thin and the material that it was made of was a bit flimsy and I don't want to say like a costume material but it felt like really thin. Um, yeah, I wish these pants were constructed a little bit better. Hi, welcome to Chili's. So as you can see, it is very tight fitting. Um, I probably could have gotten a size up for these pants and it would have fixed every problem. All right, so moving on to the fourth and final item that I got from them. I got the contrast stitch pants, which I'll show you guys a better close up version of this in just a sec. I love the navy blue color and I really do like that they made a contrast stitch pants. It's almost more of like a tomboy skaterish kind of look. So they retail for $52 online. And I got them in size extra small. They're made of 97% cotton, 3% spandex. So these ones are my favorite item that I received. I thought the pants would like end closer to the ankles, but they ended closer to like my birthmark, which you'll see in a second. It's on my leg. His name is Pete. They feel a little bit different than what I expected. I don't know why I was expecting more of like a sturdy material. This one's a little bit thinner than what I thought. So, I mean, this will be nice in the spring, so I don't really care. Just like the high society pants, I found that these ones also have small belt loops and they are made of a relatively thin material, but I found that they were built much better and they fit my body much better than the other ones did. All right, well, that concludes this video, guys. Thank you guys for watching this video. I really do appreciate it. Um, if you guys have any recommendations or any input on anything, put it in the comments below. I'm, I'm pretty responsive to them. So if you guys have any recommendations for anything else you want to see, let me know. All right, guys, see you later. Bye. <laughs>